Hello again, welcome back, David from Atomic Candy. Now in a moment, I'm going to show some videos and some photos that Lady Pop Hunter and myself took at Toys R Us. And the reason that we did this at, is as a little bit of an experiment. Now, one thing that I like to say about conventions, when I go to toy conventions, action figure conventions, even comic book conventions, is don't pay attention to what's there. Pay attention to what's missing. What don't you see? Like, for example, the last big Chicago toy show I went to, which had almost 800 tables, I didn't see Weebles. I didn't see Six Million Dollar Man. I didn't see Major Matt Mason. You see what I'm saying? The reason is because that stuff is in such high demand, those dealers don't have them. You can also learn a reverse lesson from this because you can ask yourself, what is there too much of at the conventions? Now, a clearance sale like the one that's going on at Toys R Us right now can teach you a lot about what is and what is not collectible as far as modern toys and action figures are concerned because there's a difference between what collectors really want and what's being pushed off on you because the manufacturers want you to believe that they're valuable. Think about that. And right now, the Toys R Us, or as of the time that Lady Pop Hunter and I was walking around in the Toys R Us, it was 30% off plus an extra 10. So you get 30% off automatically and 10% more added at the register. And there's a lot of stuff that's still sitting there that has been sitting there the entire time. So let's take a look at what people don't want. In modern toys. Minecraft not moving 30% off plus take an extra 10% see the little pink sign in the corner there's LPH Hi. looking at the pops which are also not moving 30 plus 10% pops are still full on the shelves here and on another display Rick and Morty not moving Dorbs rock candy Still filling up on the shelves. Pokemon. See? Pokemon, Pokemon, not moving. <laughs> Roblox. Mystery minis aren't doing very well either. Mystery minis are still piled up in here. Like I said, we're at 30%. Nickelodeon not moving. These plushies aren't moving. Something to be said for that. More dorbs and stuff. Yeah. <clears throat> Look at all of these things right here. Well, this is remote control vehicles. All backed up. No, kids don't play with toys anymore. No. Star Wars is still packed. 30% off plus an extra 10. The Star Wars stuff isn't moving. There's several aisles of this. Several lanes, rather. It's not selling. Oh, my hand got in the way. Look at the Avengers. All that Avengers stuff, it's not moving. The cheap stuff isn't moving. more Star Wars. Some legends are here, which is kind of surprising. But for the most part, the Avengers stuff isn't moving either. Remember, it's 30 plus 10. The Marvel dolls. This display has been full for weeks. It hasn't moved at all because we've been coming back and forth here. Transformers is nearly gone. Wonder Woman, not moving at all. Wonder Woman is thick on the shelves and has been. It's not as interesting as people expected. Wrestling doll figures, not selling. 30 plus 10, see the other sign now. And of course, my wife's looking at the wrestlers. Oh, you found something. Yeah, but it's all bent up. Well, maybe you'll find a good one. 
it's the only two they have. Still a lot of wrestling girl dolls. Limited supply of regular wrestling figures. It's the same ones. It's newer people. The classic ones are the ones that disappear off the shelves. Yeah, like I would like this thing, but the packaging is. Yeah, all. packaging's bent on both of them. Yeah, and these are the only two. Then, right? There's no more. Yeah. Power Rangers also not selling. Pretty thick. And this, there's displays of this. Uh, Five and one Megazord and other supersized sets all over the store. But the Power Rangers figures aren't going very well either. Yeah. Didn't find anything? We found one thing in the cart. <laughs> I'm not going to get it. You're not getting it? Well, I don't know. Well, I guess I'll get, what, 30, 40% off. Yeah. I wish I could get the whole. The whole set. Exactly. Did you dig through? Because there's a lot of pops. I didn't really. I didn't pull everything down. I probably should. You might find something. Superhero girls. I missed this one. This display isn't moving either. This stuff has been piled up in here. Still not selling. This is what people don't want. Just like I say, you can learn a lot from conventions because what you can't find at the show teaches you a lot about what really sells, what people are really looking for. When there's a clearance sale, what's not selling can teach you just as much. So what did you think of that? What did you think about that? Go ahead and put your thoughts in the comment section down below. Let me know what your opinion is on the subject. Um, please do give it a thumbs up if you don't mind. Like, share, and subscribe. All that good stuff. Hit the notifications tab so that you know when new videos come out. Subscribe if you're new. Check out some of our other content. We do a lot of different things on this channel, discussions and reviews and so on and so forth. So I hope to see you again soon and thanks for watching.